Hey everybody, in a rare twist of fate, I was at my local Walgreens, this is just a wall, so that's cool, and I finally found the Mint Duo, which was not supposed to be released until December, but for some reason it's here now and I'm not complaining, so I thought I would do an impromptu solo, which makes me nervous, review of this one for everybody because I'm very excited because chocolate and mint are among my favorite flavor combinations of all flavor combinations. Here it is. It's nice and swirly and don't be confused. This is the American brand because I'm an American. All right, here we are. Now look away. Don't watch me eat. Maybe there's a dog or something outside. There is no dog. Okay, that was fun. I'm not disappointed, but it's not as flavorful as it smells. Like, actually, it tastes exactly like it smells, and it smells delicious, and it tastes delicious. It's just not as impactful of a mint combination as I thought it would be. There was a bird up there. Um, I'm really happy with it, and they're currently on sale, king size, two for $2, which is a great deal because they're usually about $1.50 each in the first place, so you might as well get two for 50 cents more. Um, so yeah, really excited, still happy with it. Probably my second favorite, the original milk chocolate, even though it's the Hershey's US, not as good as the previously reviewed UK version of the milk chocolate bar. That one's still my favorite. This one is now my second favorite. All right. See you later, everybody. So I am back with a follow-up review for this because I had more bites of it like you do when you eat an entire piece of candy. You don't just eat the end off and then leave it like Ramona Quimby. Um, the more I ate this, the more I really liked it. It's still my number two in comparison, but higher regard because after letting it marinate in my mouth, I guess would be a poor choice of words, but a good one? I don't know. Um, I found the dark chocolate of it not to be as bitter as the plain dark chocolate, but the mint does seem to last a little bit longer in your mouth than I anticipated the first time. So try this one. It's really good. You can trust me because I have had over 26 varieties of Kit Kats as of today. So happy Sunday or any other day of the week that it happens to fall on that you're watching this and whatnot. Um, see you later. Bye.